just the, yeah. Hi, I'm Christy Humberger. And I'm Celine Johnson. And together, we're the Crazy, Crazy Book Ladies. So today is a special day. This is a kindergarten class that has been virtual and in person for the last six months. Mm -hmm. Today, some of these students, it's their first time in the library, and we are so excited. So I hope you're excited too. So let's bring them on in. All right, okay, let's get them. Good morning. Come on in. Good morning, my friends, my pelicans. Let's go and find a dot, and you can stand on a dot. We're gonna stand. Can you stand? Stand on a dot. Find a dot. Hiker, stand. Stand up. Let's find the dot. Perfect. You found a dot. There's a dot right here. But that's a dot. Awesome. We've got some birthday friends here. Super. Well, good morning, my pelicans. So we're gonna stand. Super. How are you today? Oh, I'm so glad. And you know what? Hi, my friends. Yay! Well, boys and girls, we are so happy to have you this morning. We've got birthday students, and we have some friends, Mrs. Johnson, yeah. who have not been to the library yet. Oh, my goodness. So, so should we welcome. introduce ourselves? I think we should. So I'm going to take my mask off really quick so you can see my face. I'm Mrs. Humberger and I'm the media specialist. And I'm Mrs. Johnson and I'm the assistant to the media specialist. So we're gonna do a couple of things today, but the first thing we're gonna do is something I love. And that's we're going to sing and dance. Do you guys like to sing and dance? Yeah. Yay! So I'm going to teach you a song today. It's called Hello Neighbor. And there are some hand movements that you need to do with me to dance. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to do this. I'm going to sing and you're going to wave your hand. Can you do that? Yeah. Okay, everybody wave okay. your hand. Show me Hello how you do Hello neighbor, what do you say? Okay, switch hands. It's going to be a happy day. Now we're going to greet our neighbors. And to greet our neighbors, we're going to bow. So you're going to put one hand in front on your belly. And you're going to put the other hand behind. And I'm going to sing, greet your neighbor. And you're going to bow. Very fancy today. Now this is the fun part. Then we get to boogie on down. So ready to do this, boogie on down. And then I'll sing, give a clap. And then you're gonna look at your dot and you're gonna turn around on your dot and turn around. <gasps> they did it. Okay, so now let's see if you remember those moves. Are you ready? Okay, so put your hand up like we're gonna wave. Hello, neighbor, what do you say? Change hands. It's going to be a happy day. Now get ready to bow. Greet your neighbor. Okay, get your hands ready. Ready? Boogie on down. Give a clap and turn around. Do you guys think you can do it a little bit faster? Yeah. Okay, okay. Ready? I'm ready. Hello, neighbor. What do you say? It's going to be a happy day. Get ready. Greet your neighbor. Boogie on down. Give a clap and turn around. You guys kiss your brain. You did a good job. Yeah. Good job. Can everybody sit on their dot crisscross applesauce? <gasps> good job. So today we are going to learn all about rhyming words. And we're going to start with a poem. And this poem is called I Am Me. Can you? 
you repeat that for me? I am me. And this is the poem. I am not, oh, I'll read it and you can, you can follow along. I am not a crocodile. I am not a bee. I am not a monkey. I am me. So guess what? We're going to put some hand motions to this too, okay? So, I am not a crocodile. I am not a bee. I am not a monkey. <laughs> I am everybody put your hands up go me. Should we do that again? Yeah. Okay, ready? I am not a crocodile. I am not a beep. I am not a monkey. <laughs> your thinking mm. brains on. Good. I'm looking at this picture and how do I know that this word right here is crocodile and it's not alligator? Because that picture sort of looks like an alligator. So what lets me know it in this like, word it looks like a, that it's not alligator? A big guy. Think, think, think. Think. Oh, London's thinking. Can you turn to a partner and tell them? Turn to a partner and tell them. Why do you think that word is not alligator? What do you think? What do you think? Okay, turn back. Okay. Who thinks they can tell me the answer? What do you think the answer is? How do I know that word's not alligator? Because he, he looks like a crocodile. He does look like a crocodile, and there's a very important clue. What? Because there's a different sentence. There's a different. And there's a T um, 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 in the beginning. There is. When I look at this word, crocodile, I hear the sound E. Mm, I hear the sound. Can you say the sound? Now, say the word crocodile. Crocodile, crocodile begins with the sound. Alligator does not begin with the sound. It does. So that's how I sometimes can figure out what words are just by listening to the letters. And today we're going to do something really fun. Oh, I, love I know, do you love fun? Yeah. 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 So today we're going to do something fun because it's all about listening. So everybody, I want you to reach in your pocket and I want you to put on your listening ears. Wiggle them a little. Because today is all about listening to the ends of words. We're going to be rhyming today. Does anybody know what a rhyme is? No. Do you know what a rhyme is? Mm. Do rhymes happen at the beginning of words or the end of words? End. End. The end. Yes, they do. They happen at the end. So we don't care what's at the beginning they of the sound, word. Um, same at the end. They sound the same at the end. Now, I have a question to ask. Close your eyes. And I'm going to give you two words from our poem. And if they rhyme, I want you to give me a thumbs up. Ready? Close your eyes. Be me. Do those two words rhyme? Thumbs up if they do. Thumbs down if they don't. <gasps> Whoa, look at that, Mrs. Tudor. You can open your eyes because the right answer is they sound the same at the end, so they do rhyme. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, give yourselves a pat on the back. Well, today we're going to read a silly story. 
I know. It's about a monkey and a duck. What is it? <laughs> yes. It's a monkey and a duck. So I want you to use your listening ears to hear words that rhyme, that have the same sounds at the yeah. end, right? Now, before we read this story, I have to tell you, monkey and duck are going to enter a contest. And Michaela, the prize for the contest is a cruise. Does anybody know what a cruise is? A birthday girl, Alexa, do you know what a cruise is? When you go on a boat in deep water. When you go on a boat in deep water, yes! Oh my goodness, can everybody give her a round of applause? It is, it's when you go on a vacation, but you're on a boat and you're on the water. So my story today is called Monkey and Duck Quack Up. And it's written by Jennifer Hamburg and it's illustrated by Edwin Fotheringham. Brenda, can you get her back up front? Perfect. So remember, you've got your listening ears on and you are listening for rhyming words. Perfect. Monkey and duck quack up. Oh, look. What sound does a duck make? Quack, 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 quack. These pages are just filled with the word quack, 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 quack. Quack. I know it's so silly. Oh, there is monkey in a tree, and duck has something in his hand. A yo-yo, yes, yo-yo. Yo-yos can be very tricky. So, monkey and duck, quack up. And remember, our goal for today is to listen to words that rhyme. Perfect. So here we go. Monkey spies a bright blue sign hanging from a nearby vine. Rhyming contest, enter now. Register with Blue the Cow. Find a friend and rhyme and choose. Winners win a three-day cruise. Oh, Alexa told us that a cruise is when you go on a boat and there's lots of people and you go on the water. So they can win a cruise. Monkey screeched ah! <laughs> and turned to duck. Buddy old pal, are we in luck? We can do this. We can rhyme. We're young, we're hip, we're in our prime. We'll find the perfect words to use, and then we'll win that three-day cruise. Quack. I'll Quack. say a rhyme. You say one back. Quack. Sound good to you? Um. And Duck said, Quack. 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 So, close your eyes again. Thumbs up if these two words rhyme. Are you ready? Yeah. Back. Quack. Do those words rhyme? Back, quack. Okay, turn your eyes open. Oh, back and quack have the same ending sound. So your thumb should be up. Perfect. Mm, beat, sheet, meet, greet. Eat some wheat, then wash your feet. Have a seat, trick or treat. Hear a fence go tweet, tweet. Quack. Quack. I don't think Duck knows how to rhyme. Oh, no, 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 you silly bird. Saying quack <coughs> is just absurd. Really, Duck, we cannot lose. I want to win that three-day oh. cruise. Look, he's so happy. He's like, oh, we got to do this. Iker, we got to do it. Hi, fly. Sky, sky, eat a spicy pizza pie. Take high a tie, be a spy, say hello and wave good. Bye. Quack. Does duck know how to rhyme? No. no. Well, monkey puffed. He went, huh. Okay, look, duck. Clearly, you're a wee bit stuck. Stand up straight and lace your shoes. We must be on that three-day cruise. Yes. Don't turn the pan until someone says that. Oh, what's that? Float, note, float, scope. Please don't vote. Let's play jump rope. Learn to loaf, try to cope. Take a bath with lots of... Oh, you guys got 
love it now. Oh, oh you're smarties. She does say that. She yeah. does. Well, monkey stared and duck stared back. Any chance you won't say quack. Think of seagulls. Think blue skies. Think about a pink sunrise. I can swim and you can snooze, but first we need that three-day cruise. <sighs> Pig, jig, twig. Oh, yes, he's eating. And oh, he's dancing. Michaela, can everybody, can you do this? I wonder what Duck is doing. What do you think? Okay, well, let's, oh, this is Mrs. Humburger. This is what I would do on a cruise. Look at him. He's in the swimming pool on a float with, with a book. Yeah, with the book. I wish I could just tell that in my head. Yeah, I know. Would you get a book? Well, hey, duck! Monkey duck. said with a grin. You know, I always knew we'd win. Oh, I don't think he knew, always knew. Yeah. The two of us, we have a knack. Don't you agree? And duck said. Yeah. Hey, let's go get some ice cream. What? <laughs> he said something else besides the word. Wow. Oh my goodness. That was so silly. I'm going to say one more thing. Did you yes. like that story? Yes. 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 Did yes. your yes. listening ears hear yes. rhyming words? Yes. Okay. Yes. Well, are you ready now? Because yes. you are now becoming my pelican. Okay, so everybody is going to get a pelican. On one side it's green, and on one side it's red. Okay, so we're going to pass out our pelicans. Thank you. And then we are going to play a game. So here we go. I'm going to show you how we're going to play the game. Once you get your pelican, so look, on one side it's green, and on the other side it is red. 
So if my two pictures rhyme, then you are going to show me the green side of the pelican. So I everybody like show me the green lost. side of the pelican. Oops, Thank you, you. Show me the green. And if the words do not rhyme, guess what? You're going to flip it and you're going to show me the red. Okay, so let's practice. I have two pictures. And those pictures are bear and chair. Think about it. Don't tell me anything. Bear, chair. Remember, rhyming words are different at the beginning, but they sound the same at the end. So what do you think? Bear, chair. Do they rhyme? Show me your pelican. Oh, does everybody have their green side out? Yes! Yay! Yes. Yes. Bear and chair have a different beginning, but they sound the same at the end. So we're going to put that under our thumbs up. Okay, are you ready? Let's see. Ian, can you pick another one? Okay, so now, ooh, there are two pictures here. Two pictures. Cat, fish. Cat, fish. Do they rhyme? Do they rhyme? Cat, fish. Oh my gosh, is everybody holding up their red? Yes. Yes. So we're going to put that on the thumbs down because those don't rhyme. Okay, who else would like to pick one? Would you like to pick one? Awesome. Okay, Miles. Oh. Here we go. Oh, let's see those ears. Okay. Fox, Fox and rake. Fox Ooh. and rake. Do those words rhyme? Think. Fox and rake. Let's see, I need to see everybody's. Oh, I love when you hold them way up because that lets me know you really know your rhyming words. That's right. Mrs. Johnson, do fox and rake sound the same? No, they do not. They do not. So we're going to put it over here under the thumbs down. Okay, so this one, I am not going to tell you the word. Nope, I'm not going to tell you what the pictures are. And you have to be quiet. And I want to see, do you know, do those words rhyme? Kayla, look. Okay, look, put those words in your head. I cannot be quiet. Be quiet. And then put up your sign. Do you think yes, it rhymes, or no, it doesn't because rhyme? This is when we use, we listen. Now that you have them up, I'm going to say he, be, he, be. You can change your mind. Now, do you want to change your mind or not? You can, but he, be. <gasps> Mrs. Johnson, yes. everybody, ready? Yes! 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 Those yes! words rhyme. Okay, and we'll do one more. We'll do one more. Iker, would you like to pick one? Oh, this a is a, one? I think so. Hint. Should we give him a hint? Would you like a hint? Yeah. yeah. I will tell yeah. you the pictures. So you listen. Bird, sun. Bird, Bird sun. sun. Bird, sun. Do they have the same ending sound? We're listening. Bird, sun. D. I hear bird d, d, and I hear sun n, n. Do n and d sound the same? No. no. So you should have a red stick. Perfect. Okay, so we're going to get into partners, and I am going to ask you, I'm going to give you a word, and you're, I want you and your partner to come up with a rhyming word. So Michaela, you and I are going to be partners. You two are going to be partners. You two will be partners. You will be partners. You're going
going to be partners with Ian. So Ian, turn around. You're going to be partners right there. So turn around. Iker, you can turn around and be a partner. And Mrs. Johnson, will you be a partner? Woohoo! Okay, so ready? You are going to, I'm going to give you a word. Turn around. Turn around. I'm going to give you a word, and your team is going to come up with a rhyming word. Are you ready? ready? The first word is cat, like cat. So turn around. London. Did you give one? Oh, what when I play baseball and I hold something? Do you know what that's called? A bat. A bat. So cat. What did we just say? Bat. bat. Awesome. Iker, what did your team come up with? Cat. Hmm. Oh, cat. 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 Yes. Good job. Oh, and Rick. your team. Oh, okay, good. One more, we're gonna try. Ready? Are you ready? All right. Okay, are you ready? The word is log, log, log. That's a good one. So turn to your partners, turn to your partner and share. Log, what word rhymes with log? Okay, Pelican's up. Oh! Okay, who would like to share? Michaela. So if I say log, what rhymes with log? Frog. Did anybody else say frog? Yeah. Yay! Did any other team have a different word that rhymes with log? What was your team? Log. Well, log. I said log. log. What about whoop, whoop? Dog. 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 Oh, and another name for a pig is a hog. Mm -hmm. So there are lots of rhyming log. words. So log. do you think that you guys are rhyming winners today? Yeah. yeah. So everybody turn back around, crisscross applesauce. <gasps> and I want you to give the fireworks cheer. Have you ever done the fireworks cheer before? Because no! we need to celebrate. So set your pelican right in front of you, yeah. right down in front of you. Okay, and this is how the fireworks cheer goes. Are you ready? You put your hands like this, and just like they shoot off a firework, and they go, <laughs> and then you clap your hands, and you go, Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Should we do that again? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you ready? I don't know how it works. Yeah. Yeah. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Awesome. Can you do me a favor, boys and girls? Yeah. I want you to turn over, and there's a camera over there. And I want you to wave. And I want you to say, we are Mrs. Tudor's class. We are Mrs. Tudor's class. Yay! Okay, are you ready now yeah. to check out a book? Yeah. Okay, well, we're going to say goodbye to our friends. Bye, Mama. Bye. And we're going to go check out a book. Bye. 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 Okay. Bye. 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 Bye.